automatic negative thoughts, negative thoughts that automatically enter a person's mind during certain situations, oftentimes outside of their consciousness and awareness. Automatic negative thoughts. So the thing that we do in our minds is sometimes our minds are programmed to jump straight to the worst case scenario, right? And when our minds jump, how many is, has that, raise your hands if that ever been you. You go straight to the worst case scenario, right? And how many of you have ever had a situation where you're dealing with something and then uh, automatic thoughts comes in and then you build a story in your head, right? Like this person isn't texting me back. Maybe I didn't call them before. Now they're mad they didn't communicate with me and I didn't hit them for their birthday. So now they're mad at me. I didn't share their snap. We broke our snap streak. Everything is all messed up now. I'm a horrible friend. And then now you've thought yourself so deep underground, right? Just to ever have a situation where you contact the person. I'm sorry, I was just busy. I was just, I was overwhelmed in the moment. Ever happened to somebody, right? So now all that anxiousness that's been pushing you down is relieved, right? But we have to get to the point where we could steer that car a little different away from the anxiousness. It's hard. It is very hard, right? Um, there's a quote that I say about anxiousness, y'all. Let me see if I can remember. It'll be smooth if I can remember it right now. Dear anxiety, yesterday's outcomes are not today's results. Yesterday's outcomes are not today's results, right? Everybody feeling me on that? Anx anxiety really projects yesterday into today and today into the future. So just because it happened yesterday means it's going to happen again today. It's going to happen again tomorrow. And we don't have any facts on that. Like we have nothing grounding us in that but our automatic negative thoughts. So it really is about what did someone say mental health was earlier? Mindset. Someone said mindset, right? Mindset is important. Do we realize that we are really our masters of our mind? If we, if we choose to be masters of our mind, we can either be masters of our mind or puppets to the world of our mind, right? And we're going to get into why that's important a little later, especially with the social media piece, how we master our mind, right? But all right, let me run back to this. Let me run back. I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm getting ahead of myself. All right.